Hello, I'm Laura from Foxtech. If you're looking to delete and then reinstall an app on your iPhone, I'm here to walk you through it step by step. It's a pretty straightforward process, but there are a couple of things to keep in mind so you get it done the right way. Let's dive right in. To delete an app, the first thing you'll want to do is locate the app on your home screen. Tap and hold the app icon. After holding it for a moment, you'll either see a menu pop up or all the icons on your screen will start shaking. This is your iPhone's way of indicating that you're ready to manage the apps. If you see the menu, you'll want to select Remove App from the options. If the icons are shaking, you'll notice a small X in the top corner of the app you're trying to delete. Go ahead and tap that X. Now, when you tap the X or choose Remove App, your iPhone will ask you to confirm that you really want to delete it. This is just a precaution to make sure you don't accidentally remove an app you didn't intend to. Confirm by tapping Delete App. At this point, the app is fully removed from your device. It's important to remember that there's a difference between removing an app from your home screen and actually deleting it from your iPhone. When you only remove it from the home screen, it's still on your device, taking up space in the background. But when you delete it, the app is completely gone, and you free up storage. This is especially useful if you're trying to clear out space or if the app is malfunctioning and you want a fresh start. Now, if you need that app again or want to reinstall it, here's what you do. First, open the App Store on your iPhone. At the bottom of the screen, you'll see a search icon. Tap on that. In the search bar, type in the name of the app you want to reinstall. Once you've found the app in the search results, you'll either see a cloud icon with a little arrow pointing down or a Get button depending on whether you've downloaded the app before. Tap on that icon or the Get button, and your iPhone will begin downloading the app again. Once the app has finished downloading, it will automatically install on your device, and you'll find it back on your home screen. From there, you can tap to open it just like any other app. If the app required you to log in or had any saved data, you might need to re-enter your details or restore your information, depending on how the app works. And that's all there is to it. Deleting and reinstalling an app on your iPhone can be a useful way to troubleshoot issues with the app or simply clear some space on your device before bringing it back. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing and giving it a thumbs up. It really helps the channel. See you later.